Never a dull moment with you, Shepard. You ever go on any missions like ours before? Saving the galaxy from certain destruction? No. But I've had my share of adventures. Do you remember any that stick out? A few. I remember one time I was hired by a Volus diplomat. What an ass. I guess even politicians have need of mercs from time to time, huh? Time to time? If it wasn't for politicians, I'd be out of work. They're always looking for ways to get ahead. This one was no different. He wanted me to erase his past. Get rid of an old friend who knew too much. Huh. His old friend turned out to be an Asari commando. Are you afraid of her? What? No. Alina and I were old friends. Sort of. We met when we were both contracted to kill the same Turian. Neither of us wanted the other one to get him first. We spent more time fighting each other than tracking that Turian. An Asari commando mercenary. That's unusual, isn't it? I wouldn't say it's unusual. Mercs come in all shapes. <laughs> Anyway, when I told Alina about the diplomat's contract, she and I had a good laugh about it. So what'd you do? Well, I wasn't going to lose the contract, but I respected Alina. In the end, I let her pick the location where we'd fight. She chose some old Solarian space station overrun with mercs and smugglers. That way, we didn't have to worry about hurting any innocent bystanders. <laughs> she always was a bit of a softie. What happened on the station? What didn't happen? For two days, I chased her through that station, used my entire store of ammunition, had to kill a bunch of mercs and use their crap weapons. By the third day, the station was barely holding together. The mercs were dead or gone, Life support was failing, but I had her. She'd locked herself in the med labs. She was trying to patch herself up. Damn tough, that one. Then just when I thought I had her, the station's core went critical. Barely made it back to my ship in time. I assume the Asari Commando didn't make it. I watched the station from a distance. I never saw her leave. And when that place blew, there was nothing left larger than a Turian's right nut. So I headed back to the diplomat to give him the good news and collect my pay. But before I got halfway there, Alina sent me a message. Better luck next time. <laughs> now, I'm not superstitious, but if someone can survive that, well... They deserve to live, at least for a bit longer. But what about the diplomat? He wanted her dead. I told him the truth. <laughs> Alina was still alive and she was really pissed. I told him if he wanted to live, he'd need me around to protect him. You're smarter than you look, Rex. <laughs> He kept me on as his personal guard until he died. Natural causes. Easiest job I've ever had. A little boring, but credits are credits. So long, Rex. Shepard. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>
This is the place. My armor's here somewhere. This is it. I can't believe my ancestors ever wore this piece of crap, but at least I've got it back. I'm glad we could help you get it back. I might just be starting to like you, Shepard.
Let's get moving. Thank you. Thank you for saving me from those things. Commander, that's him. That's Dr. Salion. What? My name is Hart! Dr. Hart! Please, get me out of here. Are you sure it's him? Positive. There's no escape this time, Doctor. I'd harvest your organs first, but we don't have the time. You're crazy. He's crazy! Please, don't let him do this to me. Put him out of his misery so we can get going. Gladly. Your days of butchering are over, Doctor. No! Please! Please!
That was... satisfying. Good. Remember that feeling. That's how it should be. I will, Commander. Well, I guess we're done here. Commander, I wanted to thank you. What for, Garrus? For everything. Taking me with you, letting me be part of your team. I've learned a lot. I've thought about what you said, about eliminating the threat immediately, regardless of the cost. You were right. But you were right about Dr. Salian, too. Killing him was the only solution. This way, we'll know he'll never hurt anyone again. I'm glad you see it that way. Keep that in mind when we meet Saren. Don't worry, Commander. I will. Shepard? You must have family other than your father. Don't you miss them? No. Now that I have my family's armor again, there's nothing left for me. So long, Rex. Shepard. Shepard, I need to talk to you. It's important. Is something wrong? You know the data you took from those Geth control nodes? The information you uploaded to Alliance Control? I want a copy of it. I can't pass out classified information. Please! You don't understand what this could mean to my people. Those files have information that could be vital to our efforts to understand the Geth. It could be the key to helping us reclaim our homeworld. Until our cryptologists decipher that data, it stays with the Alliance. After that, you can make an official appeal for access to the files. Right. I'm sure the Alliance will have no problem turning it over to my people. Governments are always eager to work with the migrant fleet. You're looking out for your own people. I understand that. I just wish it wasn't at my people's expense. Is this gonna cause trouble later on? Don't worry. I'll still do everything I can to help you stop Saren. But as soon as this mission's over, I must resume my pilgrimage. Shepard, 
I need to talk to you. It's important. Is something wrong? You know the data you took from those Geth control nodes? The information you uploaded to Alliance Control? I want a copy of it. You want to bring this data back to the migrant fleet? Those files have information that could be vital to our efforts to understand the Geth. It could be the key to helping us reclaim our homeworld. If I give you this data, your pilgrimage is over. You'll go back to your own people. Not right away. I'll stay with you as long as it takes to stop Seren. But my people need this. You think you can use this information to destroy your enemy? Not right away. We will need to study it. It could take years. But it will give us new insight into how the Geth have changed and evolved over the past centuries. Go ahead. Make a copy. My people, I owe you a great debt. One I can never repay. The only thing I can offer in return is what you already have. My solemn promise to stay with you until Saren and his Geth armies are defeated. I never wanted anything more. Thank you, Shepard. 